If you're working in formulation development, there are probably times when you wish you could get to your results faster. Have you thought how you might benefit if you could reduce the time needed to complete each individual experiment, reduce the number of trials you need to complete in your early development work? If you're interested in learning about an instrument that offers just this, then watch the rest of this two minute video and see if we can show you a better, more time efficient way to develop your formulation. This instrument can do three main things. It will quickly determine the optimum amount of binder required for your formulation, removing most of the trial and error work, giving you an ideal starting point without wasting your time and material. Secondly, it will quickly provide a measurement of the effect of under and over mixing and give you an optimum mix time. Finally, it can be used as a quality control instrument in a production environment. The instrument can be used both in formulation development for tableting and formulation development for extrusion and spherinization. The data is automatically presented in an understandable format and it's easy to share it with your team. In addition to finding the optimum binder ratio, the instrument also enables you to qualify the effects of under and over mixing may have on your formulation properties helping you not only to determine the correct endpoint of your formulation, but also to make comparisons between different formulations using different operating parameters. It's normal to use a batch size from about 10 to 25 grams of dry powder, but this depends on the formulation. And the results can be produced relatively quickly, easily, and are generally repeatable. If you think these abilities would enable you to save time and money in your laboratory, then we'd like to introduce to you our mixer torque rheometer. This is an instrument that is widely used amongst most of the major pharmaceutical manufacturers and a big number of catalyst development companies. I've worked with several major pharmaceutical companies and recently one said that the work we did in one morning would have normally taken them four days to complete because they had access to an MTR. I've demonstrated the MTR to lots of scientists working in formulation development Quite often I've found that when starting development, the binder to powder ratio is chosen in a rather arbitrary way. In many cases, it doesn't work, wasting a batch of product. It may be too wet, so they lessen the binder, and that doesn't work, so that's another batch of product wasted. Now it's too dry, and another batch wasted. This can keep going repeatedly, wasting lots of material and time. If you're working in formulation development, this probably sounds familiar to you. The MTR removes most of the trial and error work and gives you an ideal starting point. If anything that we've said today is relevant to your work and you'll be interested in utilizing any of these benefits, we'd love to help you solve these challenges. Contact us via our online chat on our website today or using the email address info at caliva.com. If you'd like to have a conversation on the phone, then leave us your phone number and a preferred time and date when we can call you. If you prefer just to receive a document package with more information on the MTR, then leave us an email and we'll send you some information.